There's so many of you. This music kind of reminds me of that uh, Bart Simpson vs. The World game. That was another game I had on the Game Boy that I played a lot. You could never fucking beat it. And like, I remember like, you know the, is it Bart Simpson vs. The World? Or the Joggernauts? No, Bart Simpson vs. The Joggernauts. That's the one that I had. And I used to, I would just restart and just play the, uh, the, uh, skateboard one over and over again. And like, it was so imp I always had an extremely hard time actually hitting the ramp. You know what I'm talking about. You have to go down the long ramp. And like, it, I just, I sucked. So, whenever I'd actually hit the ramp, I'm like, yes! Yeah! Oh. And then I'd either miss him or get fucking blocked. Like, I really, it was like the highlight of my year when I did that. And then uh, I never passed the second one, honestly, like, sadly. I kind of want to emulate that game, see if I can actually beat it. Or if I just am fucking terrible. But uh, I was only able to play the basketball one. I never was able to beat it. I still don't know how to beat it. That game is that's the one you have to, like, you can't step on, like, the black squares or something like that. And then the skateboard one took me a while. I was able to eventually get the skateboard one. But... No, thank you. Ow. I used to play a lot of Game Boy games when I was little. The old school ones. My mom had one. She just had a. She just literally would buy new Game Boys to get a new version of Tetris. Hands up, Sly. The hypno boxes are too strong for you to destroy with your cane. Try using Murray's attacks to take them out. When they're all Come on. Range. Watch out. Come on, come on. Woo! That noise is so so kind of just fucking. Dem what? The, you hit every teeny tiny damn thing, Murray. That's quite simple. Oh. Uh, my head. Who? What? Is this heaven? Sorry, pal. You're no angel. Just take a it's few fucked up. breaths and try to center your thoughts. Okay. What's with all the racket? My conscious mind is a wreck. I ought to... The weak-minded hippo is free! And he's got friends! Hmm. Perhaps it's time to reevaluate some life choices. I'm serious. I managed to keep this half of the clockwork heart safe. It was hard to hide from the con Oh, Contessa! It hit his ass. Murray, lift those crank bars so we can chase after her. Get the lift in, Big Daddy. We need to get out of here. Or is that me? Yeah, that's me. Okay, remember, you gotta you gotta remember wait how you do it? Press it and then just start. Here we go. Oh, it's like a trodden horse. I'm trotting! Look at me, Daddy, I'm dancing! Okay. You just pick up the fuck this chair. Here we go. I just noticed how fucking cold my feet are. Random, right? Mm. Let's go! You know, I love it. Especially with how they just ran into a wall. That was cute. You lousy, no good head shrinker! Oh, come now, Murray. We were making such progress during our sessions. The only mental help that I need is to never be reminded of you again. Such <laughs> I like every girlfriend I've ever had. <laughs> Why not be psychologically productive and channel it at your so-called friends? I'm done talking with my mouth. Now I talk with my fists! Sorry, but our time is up. Kick your bony ass. Back, back! I'm coming, bitch. Oh, no, I see. No, I don't. Oh, I thought I had to pick it up and chuck him at it. Oh. I will catch you. Ow. Did she get tired? Or am I missing something here? 
you know, things never seem to be that easy when it comes to spiders with big booties. I'm gonna get you! Just you wait! Gave me up. Oh yeah, she eventually just gets on her hot ass balloon. Don't worry, pal. We'll find her. With the three of us back together, she doesn't stand a chance. There we go. was great! The gang had been reunited and it was all because of me! Even the van ride out of town was like a party! Murray had to pull over twice because he was laughing so hard! But despite all the jokes, I think something had changed. <laughs> Since childhood, the three of us had never been apart. And our recent isolation gave us all pause for thought. Needless to say, we took a few weeks off before getting back to work. And for the first time in my life, Murray let me drive. Aww. That's just so a... Oh, oh, you little punk ass turtle, you. Oh, I'm gonna get you, fucking skank. Can I quit? Nah, let's just, just get to the safe house. Episode 5, does it have a name like the other ones? Oh, yeah. Let's see what. A Tangled Zeb. <laughs> Love you, Sly Cooper. You're so Time awesome. Little payback. I want to be just the like Contessa, you when I grow up. <laughs> having escaped us in the prison is now hiding out in her castle estate. It's a well fortified gothic nightmare that would make any thief run in terror. Terrible or not? That's where we're headed. To sweeten the deal, we've learned that the Contessa, who until recently was a secret member of the Claw Gang, is in possession of the Clockwork Eyes. The devious raccoon has described the eyes stopping opponents dead in their tracks, transfixed in their gaze. It doesn't take a genius to figure out what an accomplished hypnotist could do with such powerful artifacts. News of the Contessa's corruption has spread to Interpol. Constable Neela, being closest to the case, was granted a cash allowance to hire an army of local mercenaries. It looks like we're walking into a full-scale war. But we have to act now, before things go from bad to worse. Sly Cooper and the gang in... A Tangled Web. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. I, I couldn't do it. Let's see. Let's sell the loot that we got. Uh, do I have loot? Oh, yeah. I got all that stuff. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Awesome. All right. Okay, you, you sexy people. You, We're going to stop it here because it's 1230 in the morning. And I'm tired. And I've been recording for quite some time now. I have enjoyed our time together, guys. And I will be back in a couple days. Or tomorrow night. It depends on what's going on tomorrow. But I'll continue this. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying it. Because I'm actually starting to enjoy this again. Because I can honestly say that that, that Rajan really fucking made me mad. Like, I didn't even want to play this game anymore. But I muscled through it for you guys. And now the game's fun again. <laughs> so, uh... You know it. I'll uh, just talk to you. See you later. In the next next part. Next set. Next session. Alright. <laughs> bye. 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 Bye.